Hi, welcome back to Blackjack and Athena. And uh, so, okay, I was at a meeting for work and I heard that there was a new trailer that dropped and I could not wait to get back and see this. So, I, it's been really hard to avoid. You gonna let me talk? Lugia, you gonna let me say stuff? It's been really hard to avoid spoilers. Like, all of my friends are talking about it right now. So there's something more about Lusamine. They finally show Guzma. Something like that. Okay. Some people are saying that the new team... So there's, like, new people revealed. Like, maybe it's those mysterious figures that were at the top of the poster. I don't know. Let me look. Okay. 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 Excuse you. Jeez. Actually, heck with it. Let's watch that again. Hey, no. You cut that out. See, everyone who wants birds, you need to pay attention to Athena here because she is being a little butt much. Okay, what? Why does it say that it's... No. Remove, go to sources, go to web page, enter the... What in the world? No, it's just giving me... It's giving me a direction on my own... Uh, on my own computer. Athena, no! That is not a URL. That is just, it's a site on my computer. Okay, full screen. Okay, and name I'm just gonna I mean it's probably nothing for making best use of myself, says Guzma. Gladion says, once mother disappears, and Lusamine says, run away, it's... <laughs> You know, um, what I find 
especially unusual is that necrosma is a prism and yet it's not reflecting light it's stealing it stealing it away it's more like i not i guess not really a black hole but similar ah oh, goodness says kukui says ah when that sound came Alola was covered in darkness, but it said that Alola's Pokemon and people defeated the darkness with light. That's always how it happens, you know? You need darkness. <laughs> you can't just have light all the time. Yeah. I mean, hey, you know, Digimon Frontier wasn't complete until they, uh, they finally had, uh, Koji and Koichi working together. Okay, who remembers Digimon Frontier? Who loves Digimon Frontier? <laughs> so hard to find fans of that. Anyway. Yeah, Burnett. In Alola, on rare occasions, holes open in the sky. Holes open in the sky. She just says it like it ain't no thing. Zeorina, or no, Zeorin, I guess I was saying it right, Zeorina, Zeorina. I'm going to try to look that up. I'm going to look up, okay, z only results for Zeorina. Uh, I'm getting something in Russian. Or no, I guess that's not Russian at all. It's Italian, and I am not finding where. Uh, I'm not finding where to change languages. Uh, I think. This is Italian. <laughs> I don't even know. Um, I'm finding other stuff. I'm finding Zirconia, Ziore. Yeah, I, the only Z Arena I'm finding right now is a um, wiki source. Yeah, it says ro.wikisource.org slash wiki slash zeorena um uh, i'm gonna look it up on english wikipedia it doesn't seem to be here the plage z arena does not exist uh it's got to be some sort of plant name, right? They got freaking everyone named after a plant. Oh, that's right. Okay, the translation that I was using comes from Kavva on Tumblr. K-H-A-V-V-A-H. And I'm going to tag them when I post this on Tumblr. So, yeah, okay. Anyway. If that runaway, it's a monster, um, is really her trying to warn Mon, that's going to be fascinating. <laughs> I really want to get that backstory. And like I said, it really kind of reminds me of um, Final Fantasy IX, when Garnet insists, you know, her mother didn't used to be bad. She believes that they're still good in Queen Braun. And the... I think the viewer is supposed to think, no, nah, she's delusional. The, the garnet, your mom is evil to the core. And then you get the scene where she, where her mother's mind finally clears. I'm not going to spoil anything after that or the circumstances under which it does. If you've played, you know why. <laughs> I'm just going to say this happens about halfway through the game. So, yeah. Uh, it shows that, yeah, she was right all along. It...
And this. Oh, yeah, this is a. Uh, it's supposed to have a bird splatter design on it. Exactly for reasons like that. Anyway, this is what I mean. This is, I record with a bird not only for hopefully bigger ratings, although that hasn't helped yet. Um, those are my papers. But also to show you guys what it's like to actually have a bird. So I hope the people who come here for Athena watch the rest of these videos just because they have her in them and you learn more about bird husbandry and what it really takes to have one of these and what you got to put up with on a daily basis. And yes, I just washed my clothes. <sighs> anyway, okay, so yeah, it reminds me of Garnet and Brawn from Final Fantasy IX. And, you know, <laughs> hopefully it uh, ends better than it did with them. <laughs> Oh, heavens to Betsy. I have to go clean up. So, uh, goodness. Yeah, that is not, this is no longer the Alola you know. That, uh, making the best use of an opponent, but also making the best use of myself. So I gotta, I gotta find out though. There's one thing I want answered. Um, the thing, okay, so we know something, there's something up about how and what, on uh, why his, he's motivated to keep going and be strong and all of that stuff. And then there was like a, a line or two about his father who lives in another region. And <laughs> guys, what if he and Harata are half brothers? <laughs> his dad is idiot Kaizi. And <laughs> Excuse, eh. um, but uh, there's also the thing about um, Hala. I forgot his name all of a sudden. Hala had gotten really angry, and it terrified Hal. So um, I'm wondering if that ties in with Guzma's backstory. Now, whether or not he was angry at Guzma or angry at Guzma's father for that whole golf clubs thing. No. Either one of them. I mean, either one would be equally likely just because we, we know that uh, Hala and Guzma have some sort of a history. I just hope that you're able to tell Mon or tell someone about Mon, you know? You're able to go to the archipelago and say, like, hey, Bean Man, you've got a wife and kids waiting for you. You know that? And it's not like you're the only one going there. People talk about going there. Don't Aether people talk about it? But it's not like it would be hidden from them either way. It's like thousands of people know who Mon is. And then you have people talking about Lusamine's husband, Mon. Well, they said Lusamine's husband. And then there was, like, Professor Mon. So, yeah. We might learn who Lusamine's father was. I mean, if he was an important character, he might have just been someone they made up to, like, oh, yeah. Um, I mean, 40 is, is still pretty young, so... <laughs> I've got to say that now that I'm 37. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, anyway, I gotta go clean up. I'll see you later. Um, <laughs> no, no.